good morning, good afternoon, good evening, depending on when you're listening to me. So right now we want to do a LinkedIn optimization. So are you ready? If you're ready, let us go. So this is our LinkedIn. Um, this is our Canva. We are using Canva to do LinkedIn optimization. First thing we need to do is to click on this place and type LinkedIn banner. LinkedIn banner. So we're going to find LinkedIn banner for free. Then we'll click on this one. Then, yes, yeah, this is what something like this we are looking for. You get something like this, something to put on that LinkedIn place. So the next thing you need, you already know that you need to be very mindful of LinkedIn because the left hand side is occupied in LinkedIn. So you need to know that where you're going to be, you, any template you're looking for, you're going to be looking for template that has more details at the right hand side. I don't know whether you understand, but I hope you do. So and one of it is something like, um, there are a lot, but let us just pick one. Let us just pick one and I saw and I saw a good one up, but I'm still going down so that we'll just find a good one that has almost everything. You can see um all these ones are now okay. This one is busy. This one, this one is busy. This one is also busy. It will not help. So something like this now, like this um such a such a um it will be good. But well, let's find something finer. If we can't see something final, then we'll just leave it. So without wasting much of our time, let me just go up and just pick something very, very easy. And um, okay, since we can't find anyone, let me just pick this one so that we'll just this. Okay, or let me just use this because of training sake. Let me pick this. You understand? So listing attentively. So you can see. Um, first thing we need to do is we need to just take all this um oh. in fact is everything is just somehow let us just turn it to a blur bag a, a plain background let us turn it to white then you just put something here put this stuff here and um, put this just pack pack all every other thing to this place what is happening Pack everything, yeah. Pack everything, yeah. Mm. Then all these little things. So I'm just doing this because of it's just a fast one. But you know, in, when you're trying to like run your stuff, you just do it well. So what we are going to, what I'm just going to be teaching you is how to add them um, picture. So probably add to add picture. Let me just add them. Um, go to frame. Just click on frame, search frame, yeah. Circle frame, yeah, circle frame. Or pick something like this, then I just click on it, you know. So maybe you want to add your picture, then you now click on upload. Let me pick this one, then probably you just put it inside there and click on it, you know. Then maybe you want to expand it inside. You know, so this is it. Um, what else? And you can also edit the color of the frame. So with that being said, um, the next thing, all these things is just a scattered, it's just a scattered work. I know when you're doing your own, you should do it well. I don't want to waste your time. I don't want to waste my own time as well because you all are students in training, so you have to figure many things out by yourself. So. You can all these things just little little details here and there. Now the reason why we are putting all these things in the side, let me show you why. When you go to LinkedIn, when you go to LinkedIn, you if you check the profile area, you find out that have you seen you find out that at this um side you find out that this is the side that has more more this thing. So the left hand side is not most useful. You don't need to put so many things there. Just you can now you can edit the the top, but the left the right hand side is where everything happens. So that's why we are very mindful. And yeah, I think we already have enough space. We can even play with more space in here. 
so all these things is just all the things you get you have in mind when you're designing so this is how to do a linkedin optimization now you don't want to leave this as maybe white you can just take it to like yellow you know and just do some design or if you don't want to leave it as yellow you can also search for some beautiful background like add photos click on background and find something very very palatable enough for you, you can click on something like this you know any one that just suits you then the last thing is click on elements and you just find some maybe linkedin icon linkedin icon then click on it then um just find link something just to like linkedin icon we are looking for a linkedin icon so that we can just probably add it just maybe because we are like optimizing for linkedin so let's just use this one this since this is you know just reduce it a bit reduce it to standard and put it here just like i did for my own and you can still write something just get yourself busy to actually add text you know how to do it click on text in the middle maybe subheading and just write anything you want to write maybe you are right boss uzi all right boss uzi See, so where is that text? So, yeah, I just try something like boss. Easy. Why is it? Why is it going down? Oh, pick another one. Headline. Let's try something like this, boss Uzi. Then um, can now hang it here. You know, everything is just you with meticulous meticulously you can do something. So when just make sure that you uh, you design you design it well in a way that when your client look at you, when your client look at your work. I know I'm going to do a full video on LinkedIn optimization very soon. But because many of you are actually asking for it now, that's why I just rushed to do this. So with that being said, um, I hope you've gotten value from this. If you've gotten value from it, also let me know that you've gotten value from it as well. Then I'll just download it to my phone. When I download it to my phone, click on, click on it and um, you find it in your gallery. Then you upload it on linkedin now so for so many people that don't know how to upload on linkedin you just go here click on this place and you click on this um can't you see click on that stuff and when you click on it you can click on either add photo you know upload from or just add photo or you can just you have to first delete this one when you delete this one then you can now add the new one uh, but now i don't want to delete it I've no, I'm not ready to change it yet. So with that being said, anything you want to do on LinkedIn, this is where you edit it. You click on that place. That is, this is where to edit your stuffs. Understand? So for so many people that don't know how to edit, and use ChatGPT for this one too, or you can use your head. The thing is, what do you do? Who do you help? And how do you help them? You know, my name is called. I'm a copywriting coach. What do I do? I help entrepreneurs earn money from the internet with their skills you know i'm trained over xyz people through my mentorship program click here to learn from me this is optimization so last thing i want to tell you if you don't have a link three maybe you don't have a link three anyway that will be another another session with this being with that being said let's end it for today